Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Devin here, back with a brand new video, and you might be wondering, why am I not recording at my desk, and why is the camera shaking with crap? I'm not using a tripod or anything, I'm just going to show you. We're going to be doing my full review of a Rock Pack product. I can grab it out here. This is, you also see that my setup tour, I got hard drive, speaker, and another hard drive, which are linked to Rav Power file hubs, because I don't have USB port routers. But we're going to review this bad guy. So without further ado, guys, let's get right into it. Alright guys, so this is the RAF Power little file up here I received. So the model number here is the RPWD-03. This is a 6,000 milliamp hour battery pack with an output and input of 5 volt 1 amp. And uh, this is meant to be like a little portable router and eight, maybe even an AT or an ES server. So here we have our one button click gives us a um, indication of how much battery is left and then push and hold will give us activate our Wi-Fi. So, let's set this back here for a second. We'll actually we'll go over there. So here we've got our SD card, full SD card slot. And then we have our WAN in and out. If I can get this thing open. Alright, so we have our WAN input and our, our um, USB um, output. And it also can act as an input as well. So, and we also have a scratch there because we're trying to open this up with a knife. So, Nothing except for this micro USB in, so you can grab your cable. It's just, I was just getting a one amp wall amp, wall power, and you plug this in, blah, 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 charges it up, you know, all this stuff. So we have Wi Fi activated now. So if we grab an Ethernet cable here, this can also, you can also repeat the signal. So we're just gonna kind of take this out again. All right, so what we're gonna do here is gonna plug in our Ethernet cord. A little short cable, well, it's quite a long cable, but it's stretching a long distance. So, as you can see, we're going to see here if we get some uh, power go. We're going to see if we get some Wi Fi action going here. So, we just oh, turn that back on. We're going to go to our Wi Fi connections. And so, we have, yeah, I don't know why this is here. I forget, that's an old one name. So, we have Filehub Media WD. I named this myself. Um, because it's for touch of WD hard drives, or just to make it easier for people who access the network. Um, neighbor's Wi-Fi, neighbor's Wi-Fi, and my own Wi-Fi. Okay, so if here we go, we can go to a speed test, if I have it. I'll download speed test here quickly for you guys. And we'll see what we get. This thing can handle our Wi-Fi speeds. So we're just going to download speed test here. And yeah, we're still on the same Wi-Fi, etc. You can see this thing's working here. Doesn't really tell you if it's. It doesn't you know, say anything about inact, but about activity. So that that could be something they could do in the future, but it really doesn't need. And I would like to see an output uh, Ethernet jack as well, because they could fit that along the top and go for micro SD. So I really don't know what's going on with the internet. I don't know if anybody's using it right now, but this is plugged into a. A switch. Well, like no, it's a, it's an old router acting as a switch. So there we go. We finally got going here. So I get ten down, one up, and speed tests don't seem to work properly on this. Just that's just a disclaimer. They don't seem to work well on my connection. So I'm just gonna keep my IP address hidden here. Make sure I'm on the right server. I'm not. So I'm gonna put my server in here. Okay, and I also, guys, you can see, I don't want I can't do that. I don't want to show my IP address. Private stuff, All right? So we're going to begin test here. And we'll see what we get for speeds on this guy. So we got 73 milliseconds, and we're pulling five, six, um, nah, 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 five. So, speed tests don't seem to work very well. And it's 10 o'clock at night, so people are probably using the crap out of the network. So, we got five, and then get one up. So, you kind of see where the one up part's going to go. So, let's actually just switch Wi-Fi's here. We'll switch to my main Wi-Fi and see if, it gets any, see if it's any better. Speed test. Connect to the Wi-Fi. Yeah, okay. So it might be a little bit better because it's a it's a pretty good router, like really good router actually. 
Oh, actually, we got a worse ping. Oh. <laughs> We're even getting worse speeds, but speed tests have no relevancy, so. I thought I'd just do it. So we're pulling three and a half. Pull some on the internet right now. Whatever. So yeah. Let's get into the um like the the software part of this thing. Show you how to configure it. So we'll just connect back to it. And we're just gonna you can figure it on your mobile device too. It actually works really good on there. User interface is pretty good. So I've changed the IP address. I think I did. Set me out 10.0.1.1 and you just log in and use admin. So we've got videos, photos, music, oh, I want that. Documents and explorer and settings. So if we go to settings here, we can go to network settings. We can go to Wi Fi and LAN. And you set up your passwords, all that stuff. So I want you guys to select WPA2 PSK. And then you go to internet. I'll make sure my IP address doesn't show. Just gonna make sure. Cool, it doesn't show. It's not showing our um thing, but yeah, it. I don't know why it's not, but whatever. So okay, so you can also vi play videos off this. I would, but it's here. I guess I can. I'll go plug it in here and we'll, to a hard drive and play some play some uh, videos. Okay, so we got the hard drive connected to it now. So, we're going to actually, you can go on the app, which works better, Play Store, and you just search up um, File Hub Plus, just like that. Holy really focus much. Okay. And it's this app here. And it's by Hutu. The other File Hub one is for the other File Hub. So, we'll just, yeah, the internet's quite slow actually tonight. <laughs> Okay, also, you guys have to be the connected to this Wi-Fi to ensure that you are going to actually, you know, get the files and stuff. So, it is now done installing, so we're going to go to our apps here. Go to File Hub Plus. And we go, so this is a bit easier to configure stuff. wonder if you can actually configure it from here. Oh, you can. That's really cool. Videos. We'll go to... Oh, I don't even need to go to doc, file and folder, USB disk, movies, this hard is loaded with them. I'm going to go to bolt. Bolt. Oh, the big fat liar. Big fat liar is pretty cool. So I'll hit play. Oops. Wrong one. So. Well, you can see we're here. We're actually loading a movie. We can scrub here. See? We can also go to Chromecast and DLNA. You have to have your Chromecast connected to this Wi-Fi network, which is what I've done. But yeah, so um, this little guy, works for, it, the thing works really good. So I want to thank you all for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed. And um, yeah, um, I made a new vlogging channel, so I'll have a link for that down below in the description for you guys to go ahead and subscribe to that, where I post a daily vlog, except for one day where I got in trouble. And uh, yeah, all my social networks are also down below. Chan uh, my friends' channels are down below as well. And yeah, leave a like if you enjoyed, etc. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and as always, peace out.